guys, it's Queen Deja, and in today's video, I will be reacting to episode 17 of season 2 of Fruits Basket. Let's go ahead and get started in 3, 2, 1, go. I wonder how the hell they're going to make me cry today. I mean... Mm. It's probably going to be a Yuki moment that's going to make me cry. Probably. Mm -hmm. I know it. Y'all know it. I know it. Mm -hmm. Ain't there. If it's not a Yuki moment, it's going to be like either a Kyo and Toru moment or a Yuki and Toru moment. It's just going to be something. Or it's going to be Toru in general. Something's gonna make me cry hot, but like, maybe sad as well. <laughs> uh. Hey, that's okay, though. And that's the Because <laughs> <laughs> mm -hmm. you may not ever get an experience like this again, you know? That was me like every- OH GOD!
because it's romantic and you're not really at home. I mean, mm -hmm. Oh, no. It's not time yet. Oh, my God. Are you crazy? Hmm? <laughs> Are That's because they all <laughs> Lord. <laughs> Are you serious? <laughs> Oh, no. I'm just like fucking up and stand here. <laughs> well, too late. You're already popular. Like big idiot. Uh -uh.
Nossa. <laughs> well, somebody was jealous. <laughs> I know. I mean, Hanajima just like, mm, I'm hungry. I'm going to savor this food. Are you guys still holding hands? <laughs> Damn. with the guys. <laughs> Too silly.
Oh, I can't with my boy. I love him so much. Oh, oh my god. I mean, yeah, you're right about that. So, like, you tolerate her, basically. Or is that you? Probably kick your ass, maybe. No. Well, I mean, you... You don't seem like the type of guy.
That's probably the prettiest gift to give someone. Oh my god, the symbolism. cinnamon roll i love you so much toru oh my god <laughs> this episode had way too many kills like oh my god dude i can't oh i didn't cry though oh my god <laughs> i really thought i was gonna cry during this episode that like something would have got me and then i would have been like a hot mess but oh my god the cute toru moment like <sighs> it's too much. <laughs> oh my god. And Yuki. Yuki! This was such a damn good episode. This might have to be the best freaking episode. Just, mm, it, it's between, you know, <laughs> Rain and Haru's moment in their episode. Because that, that's still like top tier number one for me. I'm sorry. Because like, mm, <laughs> but this episode just gave way too many feels and the fact that it was focusing on all three in this episode I mean mm, so good my girl Hanajima she ate <laughs> and she ate good <laughs> that girl was like I am hungry and I'm going to eat every little thing that I can before we leave I mean the whole entire time what was she doing eating <laughs> Hey, I don't blame her though. I mean, when you go on a trip, what's the big thing that you're probably going to be doing? Yeah, you're going to do some touristy-ish, but you're probably going to be eating some local delicacies and ish like that. Like, especially if you go to freaking, like, when I went to New Orleans, like, besides looking at the stuff with, like, my mom and my chorus friends and stuff, uh, psh, I have me some jambalaya, some good behind seafood. <laughs> like, oh my god, I'm hungry. Oh my god. But yeah, oh my god. But okay. Mm. Mm, 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 mm. See, that just made me even hungry. <laughs> but it was cute. I mean, even with the moment of like, I just was trying to like, it's not cute. Like, come here, come here, come here. You want this? Like, I can't. I love them both so much. And, like, I, and I will say this, like, I've never really shipped. Arisa and Kyo because I mean yes they're very similar to each other but then at the same time they're polar opposites and even with watching um this version I still don't ship them they do have a lot of like shippable moments but I really just look at them as like <laughs> just two friends who argue a lot and there's nothing more nothing less like how a guy and a girl can't be friends without some romantic s or sexual tension between them those two are it like they can literally just be friends without nothing because they ain't got chemistry together even though the girl who like yo was like mm, yeah it's obvious you like him what <laughs> Like, if you only knew. <laughs> okay, let's see. All right, so let's talk about this title. This title, I don't know why, 
but when I see that with those words, like, the, okay, if you, like, are an OG for Tokyo Mew Mew, and if you read the manga, I think it was, like, volume three, four, one of the two. I have them right here. I just don't feel like getting them and looking through each manga to fill it, to, like, see. I think it's, I think it's at the end of volume three going into volume four, where, like, Ryu is, like, taking Ichigo, and he's, like, what a kiss. I don't know why, but I'm getting feel towards that, but I feel like, Mm, I don't know, the person who, oh god, um, the person who taught possibly is Hataharu, so, bruh, <laughs> can we just go to next Monday, please, because if it's Hataharu, mm, my husband, no, like, let's go, but, mm, or it's Hatsuri, mm, I need to stop, but my money's on Hataharu, because, that's baby. That's my husband right there. I'm like, mm, at the end of the day. Other than that, guys, <laughs> that is my reaction to towards episode 17 of season 2 of Fruits Basket. If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a like. really helps me out. Also, subscribe to my channel. I make videos every single day. Join my squad. And, of course, I will see you guys officially all next Monday for episode 18. Bye, guys.